everybody, it's Danika here. I'm a home DIY expert, and today in this video, I'm gonna bring you my top five power tools that I think any home DIYer should own. All right, so my first tool I'm gonna to talk to you about is the drill. I think this is the most important because if you're not gonna be into cutting or doing any building per se, this is what's gonna help you with any picture hanging, whether you're changing your doorknobs or your handles on your cabinets, the drill is probably the number one tool that you need. Number two speaks for itself, it's the sander. The reason why is because once you're done all of your work, whether it's trim work, refinishing furniture, your sander is what's gonna take it to the next level. Third on my list is your miter saw. The reason why I've added this one is it is so versatile and can do your trim work. It can build any little pieces of furniture that you're gonna be doing. And it makes make sure that it cuts extremely straight because sometimes we, don't, we won't cut that straight. Which brings me to my circular saw. Although it's a great tool to have, it does not cut exactly on a zero degree, but it's versatile enough that you can bring it around with you where as your miter saw has to stay stationary. Last but not least on my list is your jigsaw. The reason I have put this one on the list is I find it extremely important if you're gonna be doing any sort of flooring in your home, it can get around the weird curves uh, versus the miter saw or the circular saw. So although I don't use it as much, it is still very important in every home installation. Thanks so much for watching everybody and let me know in the comments below if there's any other tools that you would add to my list. While you're at it, don't forget to subscribe.